History of Media Laws in Ukraine With the collapse of the Soviet Union in 1991, Ukraine became an independent state, formalized with a referendum in December 1991. In the year 1991, Ukraine gained independence from the Soviet Union and media legislation began to evolve in the newly formed country. In the following year, 1992, The law on information was adopted establishing the legal framework for activities. It guaranteed freedom of expression and prohibited censorship. This law also introduced the concept of state ownership of media outlets. Then, in 1994, the law on television and broadcasting was enacted, providing regulations and broadcasting activities, licensing requirements, and the establishment of the National Council on Television and Radio Broadcasting. In 1996, the law on printed mass media press was introduced, outlining regulations and licensing procedures for print media. After about a decade in 2003, the law on information was revised to further protect freedom of speech, simply media registration procedures and enhance access to information. A year later in 2006, the law on television and radio broadcasting was also amended. aiming to increase transparency in the media sector promote pluralism and protect rights of journalists then in 2011 the law on access to public information was adopted ensuring citizens right to access information held by public authorities after that between the years 2013 and 2014 in the midst of the euro maiden protests and political unrest several media laws were adopted or amended These laws included the law on television and radio broadcasting which was amended in 2013 then the law on public television and radio broadcasting of Ukraine introduced in 2014 and the law on protection of personal data also amended but in 2014 in the subsequent year 2015 the law on state for support for cinematography in Ukraine was enacted to promote the development of the national film industry through financial support and other incentives 3 years later in 2018 the law on countering threats to national security of ukraine in information sphere was introduced primarily aimed at countering propaganda and disinformation this law received criticism from media freedom advocates who argued that it would be used to restrict freedom of expression then in 2020 the law on media was passed replacing several existing media laws it aimed to improve media regulation protect journalists right and enhance transparency in media ownership however concerns were raised about certain provisions that could potentially undermine media freedom the next year in 2021 the law on countering threats to national security of ukraine in information sphere this time amended This amendment expanded the scope of the law and introduced stricter regulations to counter information threats, including disinformation and propaganda. Critics argued that it could potentially lead to restrictions on freedom of expression and limit journalistic activities. In the following year, in 2022, Ukraine started working on reforming its public broadcasting system. A draft law was introduced in the same year to enhance the independence and funding of the public broadcaster, National Public Broadcasting Company of Ukraine. UAPBC The aim is to strengthen public broadcasting as an alternative and reliable source of information